Welcome back, everyone. Today we're doing era. We're doing season three. We're doing the episode "The Magician." So let's start off with uh, Nissa finds out about Sarah's dead, and she goes crazy. She is super not happy. She's like, "Why did this happen? How come no one told me?" And blah blah blah. And then we um, see that Thea is buying back the club. And then we have Nyssa and Laurel talk, and then Nyssa is super upset, which is understandable. Then Nyssa and Oliver team up, and they find out that Malcolm Merlin is actually alive. And so they go to Lance for help and got in an address. And then there's a Buddhist monk. Turns out um, the monk has been dead forever, and actually uh, Merlin is staying there. Then we have a flashback where Oliver kills someone. We don't really know who, but we just know he did kill somebody. And then we have uh, them tracking Malcolm to an uh, air conditioning air conditioner factory because at the at the dojo place, um, basically, um, Oliver kind of lets him escape, and Nessa gets very furious with that, like really bad. And turns out um, Merlin's is not at the factory, but um, but like put just kind of just left him there. And then he tells um, Oliver to meet him in the square, and tells um, him that he protected Thea, and that um, Oliver tells Thea that um, Malcolm is alive, and she asks Oliver, "Oh my God, what?" But she already knew that. And then uh, Nissa didn't know about Thea, so Oliver actually dropped the ball on that and said that Nissa is Malcolm's daughter. And which is not a good thing to tell the daughter of the League of Assassins of that. Not very smart, of course. And then um, we have a flashback where Oliver and the kid make a deal, and then um, Oliver gets pissed about it. He's like, look, I'll get you a thousand cookies, okay? Just help me out here. Let me use your computer. And so then his mom comes in and is like, no, no. Then we go back to the present where Thea gets kidnapped. And then it's Nessa versus Arrow versus Merlin. And then it turns out Merlin knew about Lee and you. But Oliver does let him go because of the whole situation. And said, um, it says that um, he's going to be under his custody now. And then Nyssa punches him in the face. And then um, Oliver is now made an enemy of the League. And that's not great. And then Felicity is back. Yay! Then we have a flashback scene where Oliver blackmails Amanda into, like, let, let me home. Let me go home. Just let me go. Bye. It's just like, uh, no, you're not. I can make you sit here. As long as I want. And then, um, turns out Amanda Waller is actually after China White. Or Chow Na Wei. I think that's her proper name. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section down below. Then we have present day where Nyssa and Laura have a little moment. And then Lance, um, tries to call Sarah, but obviously she doesn't answer. Uh, then Thea hires Roy as, like, a bouncer to the, uh, club. Or, like, a bartender or something. No, wait, general manager. It's one of those things. I got it right. Then um, Malcolm and Thea talk. Um, then Nessa returns home. And then we have Rise of Ghoul intro. And that's the end of the episode. Wasn't that an awesome episode? Because I really liked it myself. Uh, <laughs> actually, I really did like this episode. I like how like there's a little plot twist. And how we have Thea as being the shady one this time. And not Oliver really being the shady person. So, it's kind of neat that uh, now Thea's the one that's keeping secrets. kind of like a 360 about it. So, um, not a 360, dummy. It's a 180. 360s go back to where you started. Anyway, uh, so I really do like this episode a lot. Um, it was really good. I like the direction everyone's going in. And, um, can't wait to see what's next again, because like I said, I've seen every episode, but I just feel like I need to review it so I can refresh myself. For people who have never seen the episode, they at least have a jump start on what's happening, just in case they do get curious for season six that's coming up in October. So hopefully y'all will continue to watch, and I'll continue to put out videos, whether people watch it or not, basically. <laughs> 
So anyway, um, that's going to do it for me. So if you like this, like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what you think. And wait, if you want me to write to something else, whether it's music or TV show or movies, I have a bunch of movies I could do as well. So that's going to do it for me, like I said. So just subscribe for more stuff that will be coming up soon. I'll see you on my next video. And have a super awesome day. And I finish under six minutes. Yay.